It's about to start again. We are just days away, but transitioning from summer back into the school year can be difficult, not for your kids, but the entire family. So joining us to navigate this, helping the kids get back on the routine is Dr. Josh. So Dr. Josh, what is the most important tip parents need to know right now? I think you have two choices. You okay. either can do nothing, <laughs> and then I wish you lots of luck, and it's gonna be a <laughs> grim first day, or you can do a few simple tweaks um, that will really help. And the number one thing really is getting kids back on a normal sleep schedule. You know, it's, it's not even so much that they stay up so late, but their sleep schedule is kind of erratic and that doesn't bode well for the first day of school. So I always tell parents, just start getting things consistent, start bringing things a little bit earlier so that at least by the first day you're getting close to a consistent schedule. That's the first thing. Okay. And so we have like probably about a week yeah. until school. So that's enough time to get the ch schedule Plenty back Plenty of time. And okay. it doesn't have to be exact. Just keep it consistent and sort of bring it back. The second thing is to really start priming their brain. Okay. Um, there's a <laughs> lot of kids, you know, who do academics over the school year, but there's a lot of kids who don't. And so just some simple reading, some simple mathematics, really what you're doing is you're getting the brain ready, their brain ready, for what's going to come at them in the beginning of the school year. So it makes the transition easier. This is not, they don't have to put in three hours every day all the way up to the school day. No, they do not have to okay, do that. Okay, okay. <laughs> the third is, and this is kind of an interesting one, there's always uh, school orientation. Mm -hmm. um, go to them and make sure you spend enough time there. But sometimes kids will still feel nervous Offer your child a, a, a ride around the school campus. Just seeing the environment, even if it's the outside, is super helpful. And then the final one is probably the most important. Yeah. Your kids are going to be spun up. They're going to be anxious. They're going to be nervous. You have to stay calm. Otherwise, it just becomes a dumpster fire. And I love that because that's good advice for everything. You oh, yes. Your, your kids are always looking for you to gauge the situation. So. Absolutely. Now, what if you drop your child off and you cry, but they don't? Um, as long as they don't see you cry, you're fine. Oh, I know. That's so hard. <laughs> All right. We already did the first day of kindergarten. I think yes. second grade will be good. As Absolutely. always, Dr. Josh, we appreciate you being here and your expertise. Thanks, Mark.